Good evening, New Year's people. As we say goodbye, except for the people who want to welcomed in a new year, like the other side of the world, basically Australia, Europe, the Middle East, Asia, Paris and London, and Amsterdam and all that stuff over there. Of course, it's like 7.30 almost here, so we have like hours to go until the big ball drops. But months ago, I did a video on Universal Orlando, and I'm going to do one on Magic Kingdom and Epcot, my dear favorite Disney World Park, so apart from Disneyland. Obviously, which is in California, and Disneyland is in Lake Buena Vista, Florida, not Orlando. I've only been to Hollywood Studios once, but I don't know why. Personally, I don't think there's a lot that I like. Sorry to all the Hollywood Studios people who like it. I mean, when the Osborne line is going away, it's. I don't know. And the other things that have gone away. And they're like, um, the Backlot Tour. Oh, I like Little Mermaid, though. And Animal Kingdom has Kali and Everest, and, you know, there's a few things that I like there. But Magic Kingdom is like, and I've kind of, you know, what do I prefer? I've seen Magic Kingdom was modeled after Disneyland. It opened in 71, well, Disneyland opened in 1955, which is just at its 60th birthday in July. It is hard to believe. And they look the same, they are different though. I mean, I like pretty much all the rides there Pirates, Haunted Mansion, the Tiki Room, even though I haven't been to it for a while. It's a small world, even though the song does drive everybody crazy. Um, there's the carpets of Aladdin, Jungle Cruise, Main Street. Jeez, I'm trying to think of it. It's like mostly everything. And of course, there's Soren, based on the one at California Adventure, just next to Disneyland, of course. Built on what used to be an old parking lot, and that opened in 2001. But anyway, the cut opened in 1982 before I was born, and you know, there's the, they have Mission Space, which made me very sick, and I had to go back to the hotel and go to bed, which is not fun, of course. Um, there's Ellen's Energy Adventure with Bill Nye the Science Guy and Ellen DeGeneres and Jamie Lee Curtis and it's kind of long actually but it's fun and it's good for if you want to escape the Florida sun and and test track and Figment when it's open and Spaceship Earth the big ball as my family calls it and they live in Sarasota Florida so it's you know, only a couple hours away. And when I someday if I move to Florida I'm gonna try to live at near Disney and Universal. Like I said I did a video on Universal. The only thing I don't like about Universal is the walking. The entrance is, it takes about an hour to get through. And from that to whether you go to either Islands of Adventure or Universal. But that's a different story and different video, so if you'd like to check it out, you're welcome to do it, please. Just so to make me happy. Sorry I'm watching like all the fun stuff for New Year's is finally starting on TV, so, so speaking of which I kinda declare things on now. It's kind of sad that he has this and he's not around to tell anymore, but... Sorry. 
it's I've got there in this world showcase all the the lands and stuff. And you know, we have great food and the music and there's an amazing firework show at the end called Illuminations, which started in two thousand. Sorry about that. And that's like 12 minutes long, and then they play a song called We Go On. And then this big globe comes out, and they, which they bring out early in the day. And you know, it's just amazing. So, if anybody wants to check that out on YouTube, just go check it out for me. And also, Sorcerer Radio, or SRSounds.com. At 8 o'clock, which is 9 o'clock, and it's coming up soon, is the, that show. And I'm surprised they're not, I don't know if they're going to do anything for New Year's, like, I mean, they have the, the shine and that stuff on TV right now, so I'm, like, flipping back and forth between, like, NBC and ABC, which was, I'm on a different subject. But, and I love the music at Magic Kingdom and Epcot and a couple of songs at Animal Kingdom. <sighs> I really should spend more time in the... I mean, I went to Animal Kingdom with my friend a couple of years ago and we did Epcot and Animal Kingdom and... It was a lot of fun, and of course, when we got to Animal Kingdom, we only had like basically like walked through, went on a bunch of rides, and left. I mean, seriously. I mean, we spent all day in the car, and then we, you know, I just, I mean, I want to, you know, take Disney buses and stuff to around the parks and the monorail and I did that in Disney World in 2009 and it was very fun but it was a very hot day we were there in like mid-July or something and it was kind of like Times Square right now actually <laughs> even less people than that but you know it was we went back to the hotel and we all went in the pool and that was cool literally I just rhymed, and my roots look awful, I know. But, well. I'm gonna end this video. Oh my god, I'm so dick. If anybody can teach me how to stay on the subject, I'm talking about New Year's Eve and other Harry Potter and stuff. I need to do a video on that, too. But. I love Disney, and it is the happiest, Disneyland is the happiest place on Earth, and I think Magic Kingdom is supposed to be the magical place on Earth, or something like that. I don't think that's a word, but I mean, it's New Year's Eve, I can, it's almost a New Year, I can think of new words if I want to. But, uh, that is all. The last three words in Deathly Hallows, by the way. I need a copy of my book, seriously. It's falling apart all the time. And I had this book for... You know, so long. But... I'm gonna end here for this New Year's. To do more videos. About ram and rambling on about stuff. I think I ramble a lot about stuff. I think everybody does on YouTube unless you people stay on the topic I need uh, cue cards like they have on TV shows I mean can't they just talk to themselves without having a teleprompter like in the Today Show I mean come on now and then here for tonight happy new year everybody